Physics Podcast, the YouTube channel for physics. Please subscribe my channel. Hello and welcome back to another episode of Physics Partner. Today we have a fascinating topic to dive into, the Newton's rings. Before we plunge into the physics, let's quickly grasp what exactly Newton's rings are. When a convex lens is placed on a flat glass surface, a series of concentric colored rings appear. These intricate pattern of light and dark are known as Newton's rings. But what caused these rings? Well, it all comes down to the phenomena called interference. Light waves reflect off both surfaces of the lens and the glass. They then interfere constructively or destructively, generating the mesmerizing patterns we observe. In the lab, we replicated this phenomenon and uncovered some intriguing findings. By experimenting with different materials such as various lenses and glass plates, we noticed that the distance between the surface affected the size and spacing of the rings. The thinner the gear gap, the larger the rings become. Moreover, we observed that the color observed in the rings changed as we varied the thickness of the air gap. This phenomenon, known as spectral shifting, occurs due to the change in path length between the reflected waves. It's absolutely mind-boggling. So, what we can conclude from our experiments and observations? Well, Newton rings along with their intricate patterns and spectral shifting have proved to be invaluable tools in the field of optics. They helped us understand the interference phenomena better, enabling us to design advanced optical devices. Additionally, Newton's rings have significant applications in various areas such as lens quality assessment, surface flatness measurements and even in the development of anti-reflective coating. And that brings us to the end of our captivating journey into the world of Newton's rings. We hope you found this exploration fascinating and that you could grasp a little deeper into the physics behind these mesmerizing patterns. So I think it's enough for today. So thank you very much for listening and watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. I hope this video is useful for you. So take care of yourself and don't hesitate to write an email if you have any question, query, suggestion and even classes are required. Take care of yourself. Meanwhile, see you in the next video. Goodbye.